What is vertical farming? This vertical farming, video blog part 1, gives a brief introduction, about vertical farming. Let us begin. Vertical farming, is an agricultural method, through which crops are grown, in vertically, stacked, growing layers. Vertical farming projects, are usually located inside cities, urban and or suburban areas. Due to small space limitation, the practice, of traditional ground farming, is not possible. Therefore, the only way, is to go up, that is, farming vertically. Vertical farming, is done in a controlled environment, using techniques, such as, aquaponics, hydroponics, and aeroponics, that does not, make use of soil. With a growing population, and not much operational farmland to go around, vertical farming, may be used to fulfill, the growing food demands of the world. The main advantage, of vertical farming in the cities, and urban areas, are that, these farms allows produce, to be easily accessible, by direct buyers, and retail consumers. Hauling and transportation costs of produce, are mostly eliminated. The freshness of harvests, are kept, at the highest optimum levels. This is the pinnacle, of farm to market ideals. The origins of vertical farming, how it began. The concept of vertical farming, was first pioneered, by Dr. Dixon Despomier, in 1999. He was a professor, of public and environmental health, at Columbia University. Challenging his students, on whether food could be grown, on the rooftops of New York skyscrapers. A concept was created, in which a 30-story vertical farm, grown by hydroponics and artificial light, could feed about 50,000 people. Although the professor's farm was not built, the idea did take off, inspiring many later designs. As a result, governments and developers, around the world, would take note of vertical farming, and implement it in cities such as, Abu Dhabi, New York, Los Angeles, Bangalore, Dubai, Beijing, Singapore, Japan, Korea, etc. Between 2014 and November 2020, about $1.8 billion, were invested into startups, working on creating vertical farms. One among these projects, now being built is the, Cosmos Sky Farm, located in the suburban area, near Manila, Philippines. What are the types of vertical farms? The following, are the known types, of vertical farming. 1. Vertical farms in buildings. Abandoned buildings, are repurposed for vertical farming. But it's not necessary, that such buildings be used often. Depending on the requirements, new buildings, are also used to construct vertical farms. The Cosmos Sky Farm, belong to this category. 2. Shipping Container Vertical Farms Old or recycled shipping containers, are equipped with LED lighting. These can be arranged, into a vertically stacked farms. Fully equipped, with climate controls, and monitoring sensors. Such types of farms, can save space, and get a higher yield in the process. 3. Underground Vertical Farms Also known, as deep farms. These types of vertical farms, are built in underground tunnels. Abandoned mine shafts, or any subterranean environment. The constant temperature, and humidity, means that they require less energy, for heating. As for water supply, the underground water source, can be used. Such farms, can also produce 7 to 9 times, more food, than a conventional farm. Let us recap. Vertical farming, is an agricultural method, through which crops are grown, in vertically, stacked, growing layers. Three common type of vertical farm. 1. Vertical farms in buildings. 2. Shipping container vertical farms. 3. Underground vertical farms. Moving onward. Now, presenting. The Cosmos Sky Farm. What is the Cosmos Sky Farm? It is a residential building, 
merged together, and described as an integrated human dwellings with aquaponics, hydroponics, container potted, and mixed variety of growing systems. Edible fishes, like tilapia and catfishes, are grown in ponds or aquaponic system. Leafy and fruiting vegetables and fruits, are primary components of the farm. It also integrates growing and propagation, of beautiful collections, of ornamental and flowering plants. Also, pets like koi and ornamental fishes, rabbits, lovebirds, etc. are included, in the vertical farm biosphere. For more detailed information and presentation, on Cosmos Sky Farm, Cosmos Vertical Farming Project. Like working grow out system, techniques used, advantage and disadvantages, trials and errors, and many lessons learned. Please like, subscribe and hit the notification bell, for more video uploads, and the continuation, of part 2, the Cosmos Sky Farm. Thank you for watching, and God bless.